Hi guys, this is Vince from Dealing Philippines. So ngayon, i-unbox po natin ang pinaka-latest na Wi-Fi 6 product ni D-Link which is ang Cover X1870 Wi-Fi 6 Mesh Router. Pero teka, ano nga ba ang Wi-Fi 6? No? At saka ano nga ba ang uh, mesh uh, network na tinatawag? Ano? So, ang Wi-Fi 6 po is ang pinaka-latest na Wi-Fi technology or standard na ginagamit natin today. So, mas mabilis siya compared doon sa previous uh, standard which is yung Wi-Fi AC na tinatawag. So, si Wi-Fi 6 po is built to handle uh, multiple devices or isa siyang high-density device ano, para uh, mahawakan or kumunek yung maraming devices sa kanya na hindi siya nakakaproblema. Then, ang mesh po is uh, it allows you to uh, mesh together. Okay? From the word itself, mesh, ano? I-combine niya yung multiple uh, mesh devices mo to create a much wider coverage para mabigyan kayo ng mas malawak na coverage. At the same time, it supports what we call the seamless roaming na it allows you to connect automatically kung nasaan po yung pinaka- best signal na para sa iyo. Okay, so bago po natin i-unbox itong device natin, ano, uh, i-check po muna natin uh, kung ano yung mga features na meron siya. So, una-una, uh, ito po ay Wi-Fi 6, ano? So, katulad ng diniscuss natin kanina, and uh, it is a mesh router. So, pwede siyang i-combine para uh, you have more coverage sa inyong uh, bahay, ano? Then, kung mapapansin nyo, uh, one of the big difference of this uh, cover mesh natin is meron na po siyang multiple uh, ports apat na LAN port at saka isang internet port so um, pwede kang kumunek ng hanggang apat na wire devices uh, sa router po na ito then kung mapapansin nyo po pag bumili po tayo nito dalawa na po agad yung device na makukuha nyo so 2 pack itong uh, 1870. It supports what we call uh, smart roaming na tinatawag katulad na dinascuss natin sa mesh kanina. So, it will allow you to seamlessly connect to the best wireless signal. Okay? So, for example, eh, di ba, dalawang device ito, no? yung isa nandoon sa uh, living room mo, yung isa nasa bedroom mo. So, uh, kahit magpalakad-lakad po tayo sa bahay natin, it will automatically transfer from your uh, cover point A o kung saan or yung master na tinatawag then doon sa cover point B automatically. Ang isa pang feature is what we call OFDMA. Okay? Si OFDMA po is sa Wi-Fi 6 lang po siya available. Ang ginagawa po ng OFDMA it allows small packets. When we say small packets, ano, let's say yung mga uh, simple uh, internet uh, connection lang kailangan. Like, kunyari, nag-check ka lang ng email, nag-browse ka ng Facebook, uh, etc. No? So, yun, yung mga maliliit na packets na yun, instead na uh, kada isang uh, ginagawa na, let's say, Facebook, isang biyahe papunta sa device mo and sa router mo, gagawin niya, pagsasamasamahin na to para isang biyahe na lang. So, ibig sabihin, from mobile device to your router, and your router to your uh, mobile device, isang biyahe na lang po. So, sa padaling salita, mas bibilis po yung, inter yung inyong internet uh, uh, connection or yung bandwidth na tinatawag natin. Then, isa pa po, smart steering. Okay? Uh, alam naman natin, si Wi-Fi 6, uh, it operates on both 2.4 and 5 gigahertz radio frequency. So, automatic, uh, pag nakita ng uh, router mo na mas... Uh, maganda yung signal ng 5 GHz, doon niya i-coconnect yung uh, uh, device mo. Or let's say, uh, nag-YouTube ka, uh, nag upload ka, malaki yung bandwidth na kailangan mo, doon kanya i-coconnect automatically sa 5 GHz. Then yung mga simple uh, internet connectivity like browsing, doon kayo sa 2.4. So automatic na po na nangyayari yun. Then, uh, very simple to set up. So, kilala naman natin si D-Link, ano? very very simple. Uh, to set up, uh, D-Link Wi-Fi app lang po ang ginagamit, you'll be able to install this device. Then, meron din siya what we call parental control if you want to manage kung sino yung mga devices na kumukonect uh, dito. Let's say you, you have your, your children or meron kang estudyante, pwede mong schedule kung kailan lang sila um, uh, pwede magkaroon ng internet connection. Then, 
expandable. Kaya nga siya mesh, di ba? You can expand it. Depende kung gaano kalaki yung coverage na kailangan mo. Six or more uh, mesh devices, it can handle your uh, coverage. Then, um, uh, alam ko, nasabi ko na ito kanina. And it should uh, work with any internet service provider uh, dito sa Philippines. Okay? Mapa PLDT, Globe, Converge, or any uh, provider, uh, gagana po. Okay? Uh, as long na uh, kokonek lang po siya doon sa iyong uh, existing na ISP provided modem or uh, router. Isa pa pong uh, feature niya is nagsusupport po ito ng uh, tinatawag natin na voice command. So, compatible po siya sa uh, Amazon Alexa at Google Assistant. So, paano po siya ginagamit? So, yung mga sample command natin, like for example, uh, Hi Google, can you reboot my D-Link router? Or, Hi, Hi Alexa, can you uh, turn off my guest Wi-Fi? Okay, so ganun po. Isang additional feature na uh, supported po siya ng voice command. So, yun. So, actually, marami pa po siyang features, pero yun lang po yung pinaka-basic na pwede nating ma-discuss ma ma dito. No? So, tara po. Unbox na po natin. Ano? Okay, so open na po natin. So, kung gumapapansin nyo, no, yung box pa lang ni, ni D-Link, since this is a premium device, very premium na po yung ating uh, packaging. Ano? So, kita niyo yung dalawang device. Okay, and you'll be able to see all the uh, features uh, features we mentioned a while ago. Okay, so here's the front. Kita yung dalawa. Okay, then at the back. Okay, so yan po yung, uh, nandiyan po yung mga uh, ibang features din niya. Okay, then uh, sa side po, yun, kita yung picture. Kasi um, uh, apat yung kanyang LAN port, ano, na pwede kayong kumunik ng wired devices. Then... Uh, the other side, uh, ito po yung Wi-Fi app na ginagamit po namin. Okay, so open na natin. So excited na tayo. Okay. Alright. So yan po, ang kanyang insura. No? So tatanggalin lang po natin ang protective uh, foam. Then lalabas na agad yung ating pinaka... Yun, itabi po muna natin yung box ano? para uh, mas kita natin. Ano? So yan. Okay. So, meron din siyang, uh, of course, yung kanyang power adapter. And, uh, of course, ito po yung mga uh, common uh, or standard documentations. No? Uh, very important, quick install guide. Okay. Then, of course, warranty. Okay, syempre, very important yan. Warranty ng device natin. Then, another uh, quick installation guide. So, nandito po yung mga... Uh, uh, para ma-setup siya, nandito yung default Wi-Fi uh, name niya, then yung password niya. So, very important itong uh, card po na ito. No? Okay. Then, ano pa laman ang ating box? Okay. Then, of course, you have your uh, power adapter. Okay. So, two siya kasi dalawang device siya. No? So, dito po na natin siya ilagay. Okay. So, yun. Eh. Then, nandito, meron siyang kasamang different plugs. No? We have the two prongs and the uh, three prongs na kasama. So, dito sa Philippines, usually, yung two prongs yung ginagamit natin. Ano? So, katapit lang yun dyan. Then, of course, you have a free uh, UTP cable or Ethernet cable. So, ito ba? Okay? So, yan po ang laman ng ating uh, Cover X1870. Uh, so, Ito, um, yan, siguro pwede natin i-close up. No? Kung makikita nyo, right off the bat, ano, so very premium yung kanyang design. It has a certain weight to it. Okay? Then, uh, meron siyang isa lang po yung kanyang uh, LED light. Ito lang po siya. Then, of course, nandito yung branding ni T-Link. And at the back naman po, so here's the power button. Ito po yung power button niya. Okay? Power button. Okay, then here's the internet port. Dito po kinoconnect yung inyong uh, modem or modem router. Then, ito po yung LAN port. Gigabit ports na po ito, no? Then, you have your WPS button uh, if you want to connect wirelessly with the touch of the button. Ito na po siya. So, yun po. Ito po yung lamanan ng ating Cover X1870. And, uh, additional information. Uh, baka may magtanong dyan, ano? Kung alin ba dito yung pwedeng i-connect sa modem or sa router? Alin sa dalawa? Actually, any. Kahit alin sa dalawa. So, pwede ito yung maging master mo na kukonek or pwede ito. Pag ito yung kinonek mo sa master, automatically this will sync up as your slave or ito na po yung magiging uh, mesh extender po natin. 
Okay, so that concludes our short uh, unboxing video for this uh, Cover X1870 Wi-Fi 6 mesh router. If you have any questions po regarding this uh, Cover X1870 Wi-Fi 6 mesh uh, router, comment lang po sa ating comment section. And please guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel para lagi po tayong updated pag mayroong mga uh, bagong unboxing si D-Link at installation uh, guide sa ating mga products. So once again, this is Vince from D-Link Philippines. So thank you guys for watching and please subscribe to our channel and see you on the next video. Bye guys!